boys in the road. Massimo, our bus driver in Toronto. You said you, you said you were Mad Max. Mad, Mad Max, Max. of course. Now, what's your real name? Massimo. 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 No, in English, it's Max. Bello nome. Oh, okay. So this is our way into Rome. Yeah. Good I'm morning, right. ladies. Oh, 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 oh but Massimo. Look at him. Ha, ha, ha. Look, he's not so, wearing one. Let me show you. Ah, Massimo. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, uh oh. What is that then? What was that? What was that? Ah, this is bad than you. <laughs> really, this is bad than you. Uh oh. Bad news. Bad news on the bus. Bad news. He's a quack. He's a quack. He's a quack. Antonio. Antonio Arpenich. I don't know somebody hit us. Dan, yeah. why don't you briefly explain what's going on? Well, on, on the autostrada into Rome, the bus jolted. It sounded like we hit something, and the uh, bus driver has pulled over to the side. Unfortunately, his buddy was driving another bus next to us, and this gentleman from the other bus came up to help us. So now you can see us walking. A different way of traveling the autostrada. My foot to the train station. We'll see you later on. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. okay, we're now on another bus. A different bus driver helped us out and he's taking us. Subway station. Subway station. <laughs> Hi ladies. <laughs> Are you having a good time? Great, we walked Hello. on the autostrada. Okay. Yeah. Did you see us walking? Yes, they were walking. Okay. Okay. This is Antonio. Oh, and, don't, and, oh. Don't, and don't ask him to turn around because that was bad luck for Max. Yes. No, I didn't, but I think it's fully charged. Get that one. What the Giovanni? No, no, no. Yeah, nice thing about staying up here. Lots, lots of yeah. transportation. Okay, we have been dropped off at the subway station. Subway into Roma. So some of the signage for your pleasure. Germany station there? Yeah, we don't want that. Here, we can exit, e Coliseo. exit a Coliseo. Yeah. But I'm being bored. 
might get a little closer to where we were going to walk anyway. Let me Can look. you get like a whole day pass? Is that the way to do it? No, because we're going to be walking most of them. Yeah, I think this is going to be We just want to get in there. Okay, you got to figure it out? <laughs> okay, we've just gotten off the subway at this station, Coliseo Station. Um, when I last reported to you, uh, at the other station, Magdalena, I was instructed by security that no video was appropriate at that location, so I shut the camera off. But, we have just had an interesting ride on the subway and gotten off here. And we were presented, we exited the station. Yes, that would be the Coliseum. And we ain't talking about the one in LA. <laughs> What about those? Uh, that would be the for the forum over in that area, <laughs> and we'll walk uh, close to there soon. So, what do you think? Uh, Lori, would you please repeat what you said when you first exited the station? Oh my God! Okay, <laughs> she couldn't believe. I just can't believe this view here. I have that in my home. I am. And one nice, nice thing, it's cold here, but one nice thing about the time of year is not a lot of touristas. These are the locals here. Hi, Sophia. <laughs> now, the, you guys are looking at this place here, right, for caps? Okay, so we do have some uh, souvenir nice options event. here. This would be good for mm -hmm. souvenirs because it's got souvenir. That's good. Yeah. You're trying to find a cap for Marcy, right? Yeah. She wanted a I don't know if she would want pink. Okay, Marcy, please tell us which cap you, you Look, might like here. I, I thought about this, Chow Bela, but maybe you don't want pink. Do you want blue that just says Roma? I think she might like black. Not that one. Or she says one. she wanted a bald cap. Or an athletic jacket. How about that one that says Italia up there? Which, where is it? I think that's a too much for her. Okay. She wants something like subtle. All right. Well, let's just look around here. This is a interesting location. That would be the forum. How about this one? This is cool. Black. Yeah. Rock. Make sure they're not made in China, though. Well, I'm sure they, they, all, are. they all are. Yeah, they all are. Okay. They all are. Can't, all can't get around it. Sorry. I like it to be made in Italy. Of course, you can see authentically we're buying it. Yeah, across yeah the street that still Coliseum. counts. But how about these uh, gladiator items here? How much are they? <laughs> Seven euro. Uh, kind of pricey. Gina was looking at that for mom. <laughs> That's made in Italy? Yeah. How cute they are. That is made in Italy? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. I think these are made in Italy too. Let's look. Uh, no, I don't know. you don't know? Sometimes you have to open them up and look at the little yeah, tag. Okay, now, I don't have to hurry, do I? I mean, I'm No, not, we I'm got not. plenty of time. Okay. You have to open them up and look at the little tag. Okay, now I don't have to hurry, do I? I mean, I'm no, we got plenty of time. Okay. Yeah, so look at the tag. Look for a tag here. I don't oh, look, know. Look, there's a little pocket here. I yeah. like this. Yeah. <laughs> Don't miss it, one thing that is really good about Italy is the spirit of peaceful coexistence that exists.
Okay, we're going to walk across the street to the Coliseum in the Forum. Okay, repeat that. What is this? Erected in pre-15 AD to commemorate Constantine's victory over Maxentius at the Novian Bridge. It was just before this battle in 312 that Constantine had a vision of a cross in the heavens and heard the words, In this sign thou shalt conquer. through the basilica, this awesome arches. What does that say? Look at the... Yeah, look at this. Right here. You guys look like three monks. legend that they founded Rome. Okay. You see, you'll see like a... Oh, this is Temple of Romulus. Okay. And that those two were suckled by a sheep or sheep pig. It's, it's, their, it's their mythology. I think I saw her on the subway. So this is the heart of the Roman Forum right here. This is awesome. Right. A lot of times. 
There's the three monks again. Now we're walking into Piazza Navona. Buy something? <laughs> no. It's a, it's a sharpener and a pencil. Sure. Right over here, please. <laughs> this is my friend Pinocchio. Where are we? We're the on the band. They Guglia? De la Guglia? Yeah, Via de la Guglia. Pizza's 
smells great. Doesn't that smell good? It doesn't look that good, but it smells good. This is a Trevi fountain. So this is Tuesday morning, after a very full Monday, and Max is going to once again attempt to drive us into Rome. This we have a different bus today. And then uh, after Saint Peter, you go to see Saint Peter in the chain. It's a small, small uh, church. They have the famous statue by Michelangelo. Each apartment gets. Where would the, the um, expensive residential area be? The people live in rich people, big houses. So, suburbs. It, 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 no, no, it almost have a two. Mm -hmm. One is a big our coach. It's an E U R. Mm -hmm. E U R is very expensive okay. to live. And then the other one is Parioli. It's a little bit north uh, the downtown. Parioli. Parioli is expensive too. I just, but they have a beautiful house, really. I think that'd be interesting to drive through the neighborhood, like outside the city. I mean, right. The residential where people live. Right. It'd be interesting. So you, you imagine in Italy we live in the apartment with somebody just just a few of their house, private house. Right. Like in the states. Right. Imagine here, yeah. in this area, yeah. the apartment is 100 square meters. Mm -hmm. It costs uh, about uh, 700, 800 thousand euros. Do you imagine? Oh, uh, yeah. It's expensive. That's yeah. 900 square feet. Yeah. Yeah. It's 100 square meters. That's why there are so many houses. 100 square meters. Then it's too difficult to find it, to rent. If you can find it for to rent the apartment, you can lose the one salary every month. More double. than double. More than double since the year. More than double. Why do they have it? It's because it's a unified currency for more than one country. Eleven countries or twelve countries, something like that. money when we change it a little bit the euro because for us the euro is expensive. It's 1,936 1, lira. For the German people it's a one euro it was a one Deutsche Mark. For us before one Deutsche Mark it cost 1,000 lira. Do, do you understand?
sound familiar? And then every day, every day the people now, they go to live out to Rome. But they have a job in Rome. They must have come. Commuters. Yeah. Commuters. Because outside the, in the countryside of Roma is a cheap attack. Yeah, Everything, true. the life is cheaper. Life is great. Right. If you live uh, just uh, 20, 20 miles from, uh, from Roma, it's a cheap. Yes, okay. That's for people then. Half price for the house. Uh, for Half price? Yeah. Is that the. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. Is it ancient? Is it. No, no, it is, 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 it
This is the Church of St. Peter's in Chains. It's not that impressive looking from the outside, I mean, this is but deal. you never know what it's going to look like on the inside. We have rather aggressive marketing techniques being employed. That sounds like a deal to me. That sounds kind of like a deal. What does she get? What do you get? Yeah. Free cappuccino. And what else? Free cappuccino. Yeah, free cappuccino. One, one pasta, pasta, one, one pizza. pizza, and, and a Coke. service included. Well, yeah. it one pasta, is. one pizza, and a Coke. Spaghetti, lasagna, tortellini, yeah. carbonara, cannelloni, plus American pizza, bar. plus Coke. Yeah. Boy, we're spotted like crazy. I think you probably do better than that. I we're eating in Trust of Ev tonight, right? If you like. Yeah, that's, I think that's better. Sounds good to me. Yeah. But you know what? I need um, a snack and a um, bathroom break before we go in and do St. Peter's. Okay. I think we all need a bathroom break after a hair raising ride on the subway to get here. <laughs> this is the Vatican next to us. Is this is yeah. this fence the? Uh, the Vatican walls. Okay, that's the boundary then. What is it? It's a rosary. It's oh. Smell it. It's made out of roses. Mm -hmm. Pressed rose petals.
Now, these guys, what's, what's the deal with them? He knew that I was an American Italian. He knew. Just by, by looking at you, really? And he said Napoli. He said Napoli? He said Napoli. Well? Yes. But you look like you're Irish. No, you're from Roma. You from Napoli. You speak in Italia Uno. Italia Uno! <laughs> Number one. Oh, number one. Wow. Oh. So he looks like Roma. Roma? This, I think it's very funny. Really? He just volunteered at that. Yes. Oh, yes. But, oh man, it's just a man. Little sister. My little sister. Hey. Okay, and so. Huh? Are you buying something from him now too? Yeah. I had to get a, I had to get a snow globe for Christmas. Oh, let's see. Cheaper than Kmart. Cheaper than Kmart. He said it was a really nice special. Special. Thank you. Yeah, they got a consistent message. Consistent sales. These guys are great marketers. They, they are? Yeah. He looks like my cousin. He looks like you. I don't mind really speak English. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> You speak Italian. How do you say he looks like a relative? Okay. Brother, 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 brother. okay, I'm running out of battery, so I'm gonna cut off here so we can look at St. Peter's Square. Okay, so what I missed on tape just now from that gentleman is well when we were getting ready to leave, he gave the ladies a what? Medal. Uh, medal. Three medals. Look at that. And he said what for good luck or good luck. Uh -huh. for good luck. Yeah, it's very nice. So. Very, very nice. Because okay. we're family. <laughs> and here you are, it's like a I can take one of you guys as soon as I'm turning the camera off here. So here we are on Wednesday morning, and Max once again is sure? graciously driving us into town <laughs> <laughs> with appropriate commentary. We are in Paris. <laughs> We're in Paris? No, we in Paris. Not, oh, not yeah. quite yet. No. Yeah. <laughs> but Max says he likes Paris. I love Paris. <laughs> Especially the girl from Paris. <laughs> <laughs> the man is not too bad. <laughs> <laughs>
I'm holding Dan's jacket. You know, like you hold a little kid's jacket to make him steady. Mm -hmm. This is the McDonald's at Piazza Espana. The lower level has latte, coffee, and gelato. And then the upper level has the regular menu. Yeah, it is. 
a huge or contingent of school kids that just walked in. So, I know. Uh, the li yeah, the likelihood of us getting to the restroom might be low. Hi. Let's see. Just checking out the kids' meal, but Toy came with it. Did it? Oh. <laughs> Smile. <laughs> oh. The ticket is not too heavy. I figured that's that one. When he said that, they're not
the best. Yeah, that's one place where they don't mind if you uh, bring in the water on your feet. No, oh. if you don't drag the water in with you. Oh, that's right. Yeah. 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 Everything's good. <laughs> They're just having a little laugh here. <laughs> so, do you want me to finish? Later. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a great thing. Okay. You know, we just herbs and herbs. Okay, where's the other one? Well, it's a nice view outside, though. because we're eating fairly early. Oh, it's true. Yeah, it's pretty, we're eating California time. <laughs> yeah. Normally, dinner doesn't start until after 8. For most people. It's good. Awesome. That's it. Okay, so bruschetta, right? Right. He's called the bruschetta. Bruschetta. Okay. Bruschetta. Okay. And then just like in the U.S., the bread with the oil and balsamic bread. Mmm. Good. Good. Here's the olive oil. Here's the balsamic. Yummy. So we have my clay. So any other piazza. And lasagna. Okay, dinner has been completed, as you see, but um, a cappuccino has been ordered, and so we'll revisit that when that comes here. But the street, uh, pedestrian traffic is kind of interesting. It's regular. Lots of people going back and forth. Looks like the rain has stopped because nobody has their umbrellas open. Oh, that's good. That's a good thing because we have to walk back to the bus, bus stop um, soon. Yeah. So that's good because it's been cold and rainy. Tomorrow we go to Paris. Yes. Tomorrow we get up very early to catch up the plane. Paris. Where it's not going to be any warmer, I suppose. Yes. And maybe rainy, we'll see. And this has been a very good restaurant, even though we don't speak too much English. That's okay, we've gotten by very well. We had a very good dinner. And the other girls have stepped outside, as you can see, so. But, but yeah, if I just keep the camera here, you see the pedestrian traffic go by. It's kind of interesting. But even Lacan over there. <laughs> Getting your reflection. 
No, it's fine. Yeah. The street does not look like it's wide enough for it to hold in a vehicular traffic, yet it does. Yeah, stop raining. Play the people now. No umbrellas. Except for that lady there. But otherwise, you know, no umbrellas. Good. Okay. They've gone to this huge trouble. They went in and got another probe. They got out. They're hooking it all up now. So, Linda said, well, they get it going. We should take our coffees out there and sit up there. You might be warmer with your coat on under a heater. Really? Yeah. Maybe even dry my coat up. Exactly. That's what you thought. Oh, so, so you want yeah. So we kind of want to know. They've gone to a lot of trouble to get the heater going. They're very accommodating. Very, very accommodating. Oh, Dave's bringing it out here for you. Yeah. Ah. No. Oh, grazie. Grazie, signor. Yeah, it stopped raining, as Actually, you can see. Gina, we're sitting right where I am. Yeah. Should it be warmer? I think. Oh, okay. <laughs> there you go. Good. And then we can watch the people. Yeah, I know. It's a great street. Yeah. It's a great street to do that. I think we'd be able to sit outside oh, yeah. tonight. Yeah, in the rain. Yeah. <laughs> Just like it was springtime with heaters. Yeah, these heaters are great. Yeah, you saw my ring. Did you get Linda's ring? Oh, Linda got a new ring, too. They're similar. These are Rome rings, our Roma rings. Yeah. You were right. It was yes, absolutely. I didn't get a ring. You had an opportunity. It's a great place to people watch, though.
Yeah. And now it's your dinner time. because I looked out on the
Well, we were the only we were the only four passengers to be not in transit arriving in Paris Charles de Gaulle airport. So here we are. Okay, well, I'll roll that. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> so this is the arrivals at Paris Airport. Did, did you like that coffee on the plane? It was very good. It was strong. It was, I wish it was more of it. I know what it is now. Half an hour later, still no shuttle driver. This is their room in Paris. Oh, we have a visitor. Hello. How do we turn the light on? So there we go. Now you can see. <laughs> Hi, Dan. Hi. We're very happy. This is very, very happy. happy. Yes, this is not the Hilton, but it's uh, an old uh, hotel in Paris in a, in a very good neighborhood, which we'll look at. Get your get why well, get your bathroom? Because it's cute. Oh. <laughs> Okay, this is Rue Claire. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Those look, look. look. <laughs> You got to get the bag I like it. Yeah. Je ne sais. Je ne sais. Uh, is sale. sale. Yeah, you figured that one out. We just came from Solvay to Solvay. <laughs> This, this is very real. Yeah, this is very real. Okay. Yeah, that's the, the best place to buy wine. Yeah, you'll never do that. That man could have been John Paul Sartre right there. Italian. Right here. This this restaurant here is Italian. That's Italian restaurant? See the menu? Oh yeah, let's go back there. Oh I'm okay. The hotel is Grand The what? The hotel is Grand Lavac. Yeah, Hotel Grand Lavac. And if we were to get lost or something, we have to get back to This street is Rue Claire. Rue Claire. Rue Claire. Just in case something happened. 
they had some signs at different hotel names at Paris. Uh -huh. So I went through them all to see if Grandma back was in there. Oh, yeah. You can't get a coffee like in a go cup, so I think we have to go inside somewhere. I wonder if there's a place in there that's like little seats for coffee. Olivia, we have so many good friends in Paris. Sign says, Nous sommes fermes exceptionnellement, c'est mon pain. Merci pour. This morning. <laughs> Thank you for your comprehension. All they want to do is shop, and the name of the store says it all. Let's go. Oh my god! Le baby. Oh my gosh. Wouldn't you say it's comparable in size to the space needle? Yeah, yeah. I would guess so. <coughs> now you see where they have balloons? They have a big balloon cut here in Las Vegas? Yeah. Because they have balloons. Because they have it here. weather is good, it's, I think it's worth it to spend whatever it is to go up because it is pretty fantastic. I don't know what the weather's supposed to be doing.
can learn French at such an early age. Yeah, and they have a word for everything. <laughs> Wasn't it Steve Martin who said all oh, those French have yeah. a word for everything? Yeah, yeah. Omelette du fromage. Almost under it. This is where you enter with the different pillars. So, yeah, there's the prices. Uh, the second floor it's 770. First floor it's 420. And then I have a little bit to go all the way to the top. Yeah, and the line is extremely reasonable because the summer time is way in the way out here. part of their hooded garb. Not quite as cold here in Paris, but in the 50s. Heading towards the Champs-Élysées and the Arc de Triomphe. English is because they want to ask you for money. They don't ask the French. The French are onto them. They ask the tourists.
do you want this? Because we're making a little video for Sophia and Julia from Aunt Linda oh, okay. and Aunt Lori okay. and show them that they have princesses in Paris. In Paris. Okay. I don't know if that gentleman's going to let me videotape inside that. You better okay, ask well, him. Well, you can just do it through the window. Oh, okay. And then stand to me and Aunt Lori. Okay, Sophia. Sophia, Julia, this is your favorite Aunt Linda. And not so favorite Aunt Lori. We love you. We're in Paris. We miss you. We want to show you that they have all the princess stuff right here in Paris. Look, oh. Sophia, they have princess. <laughs> She'd be in heaven. Well, welcome in Disney Store Paris. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you very much. We have two little girls that are princesses at home. Next yes. time they're coming to Paris with us. And they, all the pretty girls, they love Disney Store. Yeah. <laughs> it's a lot of dreams. They are little <laughs> princesses. She's fine coming home tomorrow. Day after. Oh, day after. This is a nice street, Saint Dominique. Levesque in Paris. <laughs> the, ele the elevator is good for one skinny person. <laughs> we just had breakfast and we're on our way out. This is Friday morning. Oh, it's Friday morning. We leave yes. tomorrow. We never want to leave Paris. We love it. This oh, tell, tell us about your, your experience this morning. I'm um, sure. Um, this morning I went out onto the street early by myself for a short period, but it was 
Yeah. It's very hard to explain into words. It was an experience. It was what this trip is all about. It was wonderful. Hard to explain. <laughs> It's Friday morning and Rue Claire is starting to bustle with activity.
there's a difference between the souvenirs in Rome and the souvenirs in Paris.
Beautiful. That's what it looks like finished right there? I think that's the plate you get. Yeah, that's a that's a lot. That's a lot. Time for six bucks. Uh -huh. They make that real well. Get you one. They make a deal cucumber sauce. Yeah. This fellow from Atlanta swears by this place. Uh, Peter Pocket. Yeah. And then they fill it up with french fries and meat. Oh, it's great. That sounds like dinner. Yeah, that sounds like dinner. Yeah. We just ate lunch, so. What kind of dinner? Yeah, it's okay. We'll see ya. No one? 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 Just fiddling with something, you know. Yeah. I think they do that all year round. Yeah. 
Well, here we are at uh, Charles de Gaulle Airport on Saturday. This is a very boring waiting area. There's nothing to do around here. But it is quite international in its flavor. And the souvenir shopping continues to the last minute. Okay, so as our European trip draws to a close, we're going to ask these ladies for some final comments. Actually, we'll be here because the sun is shining this way. Here, okay, here we go. We've had a, we've had on this trip a great awakening. That um, on the wonders of European culture and tradition and architecture. And so let's ask, ask for some comments here. Linda. Oh, magnificent. Bellissimo. Bravo. <laughs> this has been the best trip and I love Paris. I love Paris. <laughs> oh, perfect trip. We had a wonderful time. Couldn't have asked for anything more. Perfect. A little tired. Um, ditto. And I miss Rome already. Je sais très bien, je manque de charme J'ai pas les rires, j'ai pas les larmes Et puis à poil, j'ai rien d'une dame Excusez-moi, je ne suis qu'un homme Un modèle Périmé en somme L'espèce qui régnait autrefois Et qui fait chier d'être encore là Avec les filles j'ai fait l'école La maternelle à la Sorbonne Des femmes pour m'enseigner à surtout bien les respecter. Plus tard, quand j'étais à l'armée, le sergent c'était une engagée. J'ai été élevé au harem. Comprenez pourquoi j'ai de la haine. Je suis pas peiné, ça ne me dit rien. Je peux pas bander pour un copain. Mais je comprends qu'il y en a tant que ça. Avoir les femelles d'ici bas. Toutes mes copines se sont casées. Pas pour faire les femmes au foyer Elles ont trouvé un bon boulot Ça vaut mieux qu'un mec sur le dos Y a plus que moi qui cherche du travail Me trouvant vraiment rien qui m'aille De l'agence pour l'emploi m'a dit que j'avais perdu mes droits. J'aurais voulu faire de la radio, être ingénieur ou un télo. Je peux même pas être flic ou gendarme, 
Puisqu'ils ne prennent plus que les femmes À vous nos belles, je dis merci Vous vous êtes assez bien servi Mais en vos filles, en plus de vos femmes Vous nous laissez le macadam Vous vous restez les derniers rois Les derniers mâles, les derniers loups Les nanas sont pour nos papas Vous avez fait un joli coup Ça s'appelle la soupe populaire Là au moins on est entre frères